Hi, uh, I'm Katie. And I'm Ryan. And we are Miami Mergers. We were married last year in the summer of 2021, and we graduated from Miami in 2018. Yeah. So we met at Miami uh, our freshman year, first semester, actually, we took calculus together. And so we saw each other every day. That class was every day. Um, for an hour or so, and that's how we first met. And we were friends for a while and then officially started dating uh, about halfway through our sophomore year um, and then have been together ever since. <laughs> yeah, and we also had a running joke with our friends that we had taken calculus together, but we really had chemistry. <laughs> yeah, but um, we also were both affiliated with Greek Life. Um, he was a Chi Psi and I was in Chi Omega. And so we had a lot of Greek organizational events together, which mm -hmm. was really special. We have some really fond memories from that. Um, we also both have business degrees. So we spent a lot of time together in the farmer school of business, um, studying and tutoring each other. And yeah, tutoring her. <laughs> it was fair both ways, I would say. <laughs> But um, we even had some of the same classes together. So that's another fun memory that we share um, from Miami. And then we graduated. We walked across the stage on a Sunday and then literally had to leave um, that night to go to Columbus, which is where we live now, because we both started our new jobs the next day on that Monday. So um, no break. We just started right away. We moved together. Um, after graduation and have been together since then. And I think it was right around that point that we knew this was something that was going to last. Um, and so it was really special for us to be planning our wedding. Um, we were supposed to be married in 2020 actually, but had to postpone because of the pandemic. But thankfully we didn't have to go through that alone because we have another Miami merger couple who lives here um, who, well, sadly, did have to experience the same thing with us, but it was. Really, you weren't alone. Yeah, it was really nice to have that support system. Um, but she is one of three other couples, so there's four of us total who are all sorority sisters of varying ages, graduated at different times, um, but all overlapped, um, and then all moved to Columbus shortly after graduation. And so we connected once we were here, and all their husbands went to Miami as well. And so it kind of created this really nice tight knit friend group um, through that shared experience. Um, a lot of them like were also affiliated with Greek life, so we could talk about that. Some of us have similar majors. Um, and so it's just really nice to have that connection with all of them. And so when we were all planning our weddings at right around the same time um, and we postponed ours, it ended up uh, where all of us had weddings pretty much back to back one weekend after another for last summer. Um, but it was honestly one of the most fun summers. I don't it know if you agree, it but was, it was. It was a blast. Being able to see all our friends again, it was like a reunion happening every weekend. <laughs> and it was really cool. I mean, they, they had a ton of Miami folks at their weddings. We had a ton of Miami folks at ours. My parents are mergers. And so, um, a lot of Miami people from their generation were able to attend more Miami merger couples. And then on top of our Miami, um, Miami friends, it was like a huge sort of almost Miami wedding. Um, but it was really cool for my parents who were mergers than to see us who are now mergers. Um, and so I, that's our love story basically yeah. in a nutshell, but, um, it's been really nice and We've had a great time with um, the other merger couples. So we thank Miami for introducing us. We thank calculus class only for introducing us, not for the calculus part. Um, but yeah, so thank you.